today we are going to be replacing a wood fence. Pretty nice style, as you will be able to see. This is the fence that we are going to be replacing. It's pretty rotted out. It's in a pretty bad condition. So we are going to take it down, remove it, and install the new fence. Pretty same pattern. Not exactly the same, but we're going to keep it consistent. Here's the gate, pretty rotted out. This two post. Same on the other side. We are gonna be replacing this two post gate and the section and post as well with the same style but just a different top lattice. Good thing we got a pretty nice day today, as you can see. And time to start the process. The fence, it's in process. We took down the old existing fence. I set two posts already, and I'll show you how I janked the post out. This is the mix that we used to set the post. Dry set, it works way better for cedar postings. I just I just pull the old post out that's better when you pull them out or just break the concrete to the side and pull it back out that room that way you have room to put all the new post back in so for here I am gonna have to run a string so my post run parallel with the house This post weren't really, really set deep enough, about two, two feet only. Normally they have to go three feet or 42 inches by code. I'm all done and ready for the next one. Here we have a six foot privacy fence. traditional style it's pretty fancy we call this Hampton six feet Hampton the gates are always solid because we don't have they're not very strong when we put the top the top spindles I like the gate handle here that it's kind of hidden so it, they don't really it's not very visible to know where the handle is but it's a two-way opener you can open it from both sides just press down don't mind my dirty hands and from the inside there we go Ready for the next one. Project completed. 